we're on the northern side of Shehalion, and this sandstone uh, shows very nice folding. So we know it's a relatively coarse grain sandstone. There is cross bedding in it here. You can see these beds come up and terminate on that surface there. So this is definitely a cross bedded sandstone. But if I step back, you can see actually it's very highly folded as well. Really nice folds coming through here and above very nice folds coming over there round and that's where we're looking at the cross bedding. And it's quite interesting, you see that here, 100 metres that way, you don't see anything like that. Here you can see that the bedding of the sandstone is all pretty much straight parallel and you wouldn't know that there was any folding in it at all. And so it's a nice example of how the folds only really show up at the hinges of bigger systems. So if you have a large anticline like this, locally at smaller scale you get these things sitting on the hinge of the anticline. And we can see this at a much larger scale if we look at the geological map. And you can see the beds to the north are very heavily folded. These are uh, limestones and they sit underneath Shehalion, but actually they're younger than the rocks that Shehalion is made of. So even that is sitting as one limb on a much, much larger fold and all of this side on average is overturned. And overall, in this much larger nap system, we're actually on the overturned limb of the nap.